Hi, in this question we're being shown the information about how um, much has been spent by 100 customers in a supermarket. So according to this table, um, 35 customers spent between 40 and 60 pounds, but only two customers spent between 100 and 120 pounds. What we're going to do here is, um, first of all, is we're going to complete this cumulative frequency table to show this information. So when we say cumulative frequency, we're kind of keeping a running total of what's going on. So here it says 18 people spent between 0 and 20 pounds. And over here also we're saying 18 people spent between 0 and 20 pounds. Over here we've got 22 people that spent between 20 and 40 pounds. But over here we're looking at how many people spent between 0 and 40 pounds. Well, 0 and 40 pounds would include these 18 people and these 22 people. So I need to do 18 and 20, which is 40. So that tells me 40 people spent between 0 and 40 pounds. So um, 0 and 60 pounds, well, if I have a look over here, we're including everybody from here to here for 0 and 60 pounds. So that's all of these people, these 40 over here and this extra 35, so that's going to be 75. OK, between 0 and 80 is going to include these 75 people here, and these 15, which makes 90. And then 0 to 100 is going to be all of these people, which is 98. And then finally, 0 to 120 is going to be everybody in this table, which is going to be 100 people, which matches with the 100 customers that we said that we had at the start. OK, so that's part A of our question. Part B says on the grid, we want to draw a cumulative frequency graph for this table. So now on this grid, we're going to plot all of this information. Now what you need to be careful about here is that the information that we want to plot is going to be this here. OK, so we're plotting the 20 with the 18. So we're saying that zero people spent zero pounds, so that can go there. 20, um, sorry, 18 people spent less than 20 pounds. So less than 20 pounds, and we should have 18 people, which is going to be that point there. Uh, 40 people spent less than 40 pounds, so I can mark that on. 75 people spent less than 60 pounds so 60 pounds and we're going to have 75 people so that's 70 75 is there um 90 people spent less than 80 pounds so 80 pounds and then we've got 90 people which is over here 98 people spent less than 100 pounds so 98 is going to be there. And finally, we've got 100 people spent less than £120. So that's going to go there. OK, I'm then going to draw a smooth curve that goes through each of these points here. Okay, and yours will be a little bit better than mine. OK, and there we go. Right, so... Um, we've plotted all of the points in my cumulative frequency table and I've drawn a smooth curve going through it, so I've now completed part B. Part C says, use your graph to find an estimate for the median amount spent. Well, there's a hundred people here, so to find the median, I want to find the 50th person along. And, um, let's do a, a green line for this. So we're going to we're going to half the 150 and read off the 50th person value off our graph which is going to be there I'm going to try that again Okay you want to be as accurate as you can here and then we're going to read down from there and that looks like Uh, 
that one. Okay, there we go. Okay, so that looks like it's going to be 40, 42, 44, 46. So my median or my estimate for my median is going to be 46 pounds. Okay, and there you go. Thanks very much for joining me. I'll see you next time.